What's going on, everybody? This is an episode from the No Gimmicks Needed Wrestling Podcast. Do you like podcasts and you want to see the full podcast? Make sure you check out the No Gimmicks Needed Wrestling Podcast on all your podcast platforms, such as Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Stitcher, Spotify, iHeartRadio, among many others. But you're listening to the episode right here on YouTube, so make sure you hit that like button in below and make sure you hit the subscribe button to NC Studios and NC Level Up for all your gaming needs. This is the Nerd Coalition. Enjoy the show. So, but also more WrestleMania stuff is that uh, there's rumors having that they're trying to get Stone Cold, Steve Austin, because it's Texas, and he wasn't in the WrestleMania promo, mm-hmm. what? To, to come what? back and have what? a match. Yep. What? And if, if that is true, the what? opponent would be what? Kevin Owens. Oh, I mean that yeah. makes sense. He's been he's that. been trashing yeah. Texas so much. He has been. It's what? like that episode of SpongeBob. I, mean, I know y'all don't watch SpongeBob, but yeah, yeah y'all know y'all know what I'm talking I about. Watched. I know what you're talking I'm about. They I watch. Talk about. I, I don't. You, you, you know how I feel about SpongeBob. We know why. Yeah, we know. We know. We know. But I, I miss. I don't. I missed the reference. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, there was a SpongeBob episode. There was a SpongeBob where episode where it was clown and it was clown and Sandy from being oh, from Texas. Oh, yeah, okay, okay, okay. I know you're talking. About. <laughs> what am I? Stupid? No, I'm Texas. Texas. <laughs> yes, I remember this episode. So, how do y'all feel about that? Stone Cold coming out of uh, retirement. I'm look, I'm confused. <laughs> I, I don't look, I'll be why. honest with you. Uh, usually I don't care. Uh, usually I, I will be upset when stuff like this happens, but honestly, I don't. I don't think I care. Like he can come in, do a stunner, take a bump, have like a two minute match, and he'll be fine. That's exactly what probably what happened. Uh, usually I'm, I'm against this. I'm not. Usually I'm against this, but uh, Stone Cold is in way better shape than I think Oldberg is, and all he gotta do is take a stunner and maybe get some hits to get a. He super ain't got kick. no moves to do. You said what? Stone Cold ain't got no moves to do. He gonna give us a kick, a Luthes press. A loot, yes, definitely. Stop a mud hole. That, stop a mud hole. Do the elbow and a stunner. No That's it. Stone Cold hurt his bicep when he came out and did a beat up to the League of Nations all them years ago in oh Texas. My God. Stone Cold ain't got no moves, man. Shut up. He's all you, all you, all you got to do is punch him, stomp him out, pick him up, do he a stunner. Give us a Luthes press. Yes. A That's stunner, he's gonna yell at his face, flip off the crown, drink a beard. Yes. That's all he's gonna do. Which the, he, could, the original, he could just do that. The original in a segment. five moves a doom. <laughs> okay, now. He could just do that in a segment. I'll be honest with you. He, that could have just been a segment. But I mean, if, if you, it's gonna you, be a match, you might as well get in gear and do it. I mean, it's, it's gonna to be the same can, thing. Look, what I love to hear the glass break, had had a BMF walk down to the ring with that strut. With, with them knee braces on and kick some ass? Yeah, sure. sure. But I just, I don't know. But also, for a couple of reasons. One, you know, he has not gone back on his promise like everybody else said for the money. And he he kept saying he don't want to be one of them guys. Like that you said where, you know, the, the dad looks at himself talking some man. Let me tell you about that guy, what he used to look at back in the day. That's what I think it turned into. Definitely did. Well, you know, they saved up the Saudi money and they throwing it at him. They dropping up. Yeah, they dropping you know, off at his house. And that's what happened to Shawn Michaels. They, they, they threw the salty money at him. He had the worst salty match. Him and Chubb, like everybody got injured in that match. It, it was just like old men in bloopers. Okay. That whole match I'm gonna say. Up. I'm gonna say the difference is Shawn wanted to have a match. I think Stone Cold only gonna come in here to stomp him out and do a stunner. And that's it. I, yeah, I don't think he's coming to do a match. If he does, he ain't like, got a choice. He ain't if they if do. if they call it a quote unquote match, I think he's only gonna maybe take a super kick. And then, other than that, it's, it's stomping them out and doing a stunner. But even now, then, he 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 can, he can injure himself. Like I said, he injured himself doing. He said he had to get bicep surgery for beating down the, the League of Nations. That's pretty yeah, ridiculous. He's, he's, but he's, hey. remember, that's what Sean was doing the old man twerk with the new day. Mm-hmm. Oh God. Yeah, him McFoley and Sunko came I did there, not need that. And he he, he stunned he stunned Steve Austin and then Steve Austin you know stunned Xavier Woods and then called it a damn day. And, but next thing you know, he's like, oh, And Rusev, too. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I need to fix the process, brother. I'm like, damn, just for that segment? Well, guess what? If he got to uh, have a match with Kevin Owens, which Kevin Owens ain't going to be able to get his shit in it 
Sucker ain't taking no pop up power bomb. He not taking. He ain't taking no. He ain't, he ain't, ball he ain't taking no apron power bomb. I would say he's only gonna take a super kick if that rest of it is just a squash match. Now, if it's not a squash match, oh, this will be terrible. But if it's just a squash match, just a Stone Cold appreciation, whatever for Texas drinking beers, then okay, cool. Even if it's just an episode of the KO show, and he comes out and interrupt them, okay, which which would be way better. I can I can do that. I can do an episode of the KO show. Stone Cold comes out, interrupts him, yes. calls that bullshit. I, I, now, I can live with that. N- now, question, question. Mm-hmm. What if that's the quote unquote match? Like, what if that is the it's the KO show, but then Stone Cold's like, you know what? I'm gonna have a match with you, and then he does like the Rock does the stunner, and that's it. Well, that would be like, and then what if that's their quote unquote match that, it, that Stone Cold's coming then, back for? Then I could be fine because it's, it's the same thing that happened with remember at Piper's Pit at WrestleMania goes Hollywood. Oh yeah, <laughs> and, then, and, then, and then you know Muhammad Hassan came out and did 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 and Hulk Hogan came out and said had to beat the terrorists, brother. You know, he came out there and just did dance. I posed with the American flag and shit. So yeah, that's mm-hmm. that's what I think will happen with Stone Cold. He can come out there on the KO show. And then he can he can he can fight him out there. He go out there. What? That's what get on my nerves. And then he go out there and he gonna <laughs> stop the shot. You know, stop my whole walking dry. And then jump on the second down. He call the neck and give him a stunner and call the day. Yeah, I'm fine with that. But you know, but yeah. like like hey, have, have, have that final the final match. It's like. Poetic, just that the way him and The Rock went out. If he was having another match, it should have been against CM Punk, but it did, so it passed him by. I'll be honest though, if he do come back and he has a full match and matches trash, that's gonna be more for me to laugh at. So hey, either way, I'm 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 satisfied. And, and, you know, so cool, he takes himself seriously. That him and Bret Hart, I swear, did they, they just sit there and look at each other? I mean, Brett, I mean, Stone Cold has loosened up a lot in the recent years, mm-hmm. opposed to Bret Hart, but. You know, he still takes himself seriously to the point where he don't want to have an embarrassing matchup. Like, he, remember, remember on the Snow Cold podcast with him and Paul Hamill's egg and stuff on? And like, the only way he'll take on Brock Lesnar is like, a Texas death match. You know what I'm saying? He was serious, too. Yeah, exactly. You know, the book, everybody was like, oh my God, Snow Cold Brock Lesnar. I'm dead serious. Are you on your phone talking about some bull, some some nonsense? <laughs> yeah. yeah. But right now, I mean, uh, but if, if they got Kevin Rose out there down in Texas, they they must be confident they can get Stone Cold for something. And also, The Rock was teasing something also. Oh Lord! Because it's sorry, I was complimenting him on on his Super Bowl thing, mm-hmm. his Super Super Bowl promo, and said oh, you know oh, complimenting him. I guess they say you know shout good job at the Super Bowl. Oh okay. I was you, just confused. I'm like, about to say you like you, you like. Super I mean, it was just him. This is The Rock being a rock. You know, a lot of people don't know about the Rock being around. They don't know about being Dwayne Johnson. You're right. You know so, what? I, you're right. I'll take that back. So, but he was like, you know, uh, when, you know, that's not the last time you'll be hearing from, you know, or something to do with the millions and millions of the Rock's fans. And, you know, it, he said, you know, like, more to come or something like that. And I was like, oh, my God, he will get the Rock for Texas. He come out there with, with, with the uh, blowtorch gun again. Oh. I, I believe they're gonna try to do what him and Cena did is to schedule a match a year in advance. What what you him and Roman? Yeah, that's I, I think if he does come out, like say if Roman does win against Brock, uh I think Brock comes out at the end and it's like, you know what? WrestleMania in Hollywood, Los Angeles, I want you for the belt. If you still have it, that is. Then something like that. Other than that, if he just coming out to talk, that would be nice too, but you know. I mean, I would love him to seven match with Roman Reigns, but damn, that means Roman Reigns had them both, both of them belts for a whole year. That that's not good. Or, at least, right or just one of them. Then she started to lose. No, well, I mean, Becky did it, so no. You said who did it? Becky did it. That's Becky. <laughs> they, 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 they ain't tribal chief. That ain't Roman. that ain't Roman Reigns. 